Today, I'm gonna show you something about end screens. End screens basically help you promote your other videos and they are always placed at the end of your video. I'm going to show you exactly how to create end screens. Before that, if you are new to my channel, kindly subscribe and also hit that notification button so that you will not miss out on any of my updates. Without further ado, let's dive in. First things first, you have to open your browser. If you are using your mobile phone, make sure to turn on desktop site. That is the only way your phone will accept to open studio.youtube.com. So if you are using your laptop or desktop, just go to your browser, type in studio youtube.com then you enter it will open your interface now what you do click on the content your content then select one of your videos i will just select this upper one once it's selected scroll down you notice something to do with end screens is here click on it then now here here you can choose where to put your end screens for you to add end screen you come to element click on it then select whatever you want to select here there is video playlist subscribe channel link is there but i'm not yet eligible for the link so we are going with our video click on the video let me position it somewhere down here also then scroll down come back to your video element come scroll down choose select video you want to choose the video to place inside this box so when you see our video element here it has three options one it says most recent uploads automatically feature the most recent uploading long form video this is not what we want we want to be the ones to choose which video we put there then the second one it says best for viewers allow youtube to select video from your channel to best suit the viewer <laughs> This is not what we also want. We want to be the ones to choose our own thing. So we go to choose specific video. Click there. It will display the videos you will want to. You choose whichever video you want to put here. Let me choose my own video. Okay, let me click this one. Then again, we can add element. Let's say if you want to add another video. Let's click add another video we can decide to leave it here but there's something i want you to see this red line here if these videos collide if these videos collide it's not going to work out so they should not collide they should just be like that that's when you notice even the save the save button will disappear if they collide you notice save button will just disappear that's why you should move them apart then also maybe you want to add your subscribe button same thing come to element then click subscribe or you want to add your playlist let's click our playlist now you choose which playlist you have you can click <laughs> that one that is it basically how to paste those end screens then when we come to down here we don't want end screen to be all over the whole video we want them to appear at the last side of the video when when the video is almost ending that is when they should appear what you are going to do we are going to hold and drag just point until that arrow comes click and drag until the last bit where it will get stuck also this one move it hold drag even this one click hold then drag it as you can see they are where they are supposed to be then you click save if you want to preview this video, you can click uh, this YouTube. You can scroll it up to the last. <laughs> so wait for it. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. This kind of things. Guys, that is how you can insert your end screens in your video. This is very good for you. It will encourage other people to watch your other videos. It will encourage them to subscribe. So we can move back. And we close our thing. This is all the all you need to know. Close our opening. So guys, thank you so much. If you enjoyed this video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks so much.